Sierra Space is building the Dream Chaser space plane, which is the world's only commercial private space plane. East-West produces aerospace life support and ground support equipment on military contracts. In the hangar here is XB-1, history's first independently developed supersonic jet. Human spaceflight demands the very highest standards in repeatability of all of our processing, which includes additive manufacturing. Additive manufacturing has really been a huge benefit to East-West. By allowing us to evaluate things early in the process, we can 3D print things very quickly. What we've been working with Stratasys and bringing online here at Lockheed Space is the ability to now print a polymer that is performing at an electrostatic dissipative level. We largely use Stratasys and their machines to help us develop tooling. Some of the specific tools that we're building are locating fixtures that we use to place the thermal protection tiles on the vehicle. If there is a department like inspection or assembly that needs something, they'll go right to engineering and kind of collaborate on how we can really develop something that can help them in their process. Our designers using in-house 3D printers from Stratasys were able to go see how the designs were working iterate faster and ultimately come up with parts that are better designed, that are more lightweight, for less time and less money that have taken otherwise. We have two Fortis 900s. They're running 24-7 to help us build soft tooling. Eventually, we will start to build parts, though, uh, for the vehicle. The Fortis 450 does basically all of our parts. The machine's been really excellent from a, not just accuracy and reliability, but also repeatability. The machine is ready to go pretty much whenever we are. Stratasys and Boom have been partners long before we started to build the first airplane because we had a shared vision of how digital design and digital manufacturing could help us deliver more speed into the hands of passengers faster and more efficiently. You have to perform on technical, you have to perform on cost, and you have to perform on schedule. And so what additive manufacturing has allowed us to do is really hit all three of those at the same time. We like Stratasys team and their products because they help us do what we're doing here faster.